Hey, what's goody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get a really similar color grade to SZA's Kill Bill music video. I think this is a really cinematic color grade. It's obviously sort of following in the footsteps of Tarantino's movie, but I think this is really sick and I'm gonna show you guys how you can do this. Now, if you wanna follow along to a T, definitely go to my website because I have a free pack that you can download these LUTs and this film grain asset I'm gonna be using. So go check that out, but without wasting too much time, let's just get right into it. All right, so real quick, let's just get an adjustment layer and we're gonna drag that into our timeline. Now I know that this footage is in an S-Log3 format, so I'm going to get a utility LUT that corresponds with that. So let's go over to the Metri Color. Let's go for our look. In the Cinema Wire LUTs area, let's go to the Utility LUT section, S-Log3, select. And just like that, there's like a world of difference. Now we're gonna wanna dial this down a little bit because we're gonna be combining some creative LUTs too. But if you wanted just to have it sort of look like straight out the camera, you could use something like this and probably be good. But yeah, I'm gonna set this at like 50 maybe even like 55. Now we're just gonna grab another adjustment layer, drag that into our timeline, and now we're gonna go select our creative LUT. So we're gonna go back to browse, back to the Cinema Wire LUTs pack, and then we're gonna select this vintage one. And we're definitely gonna wanna dial this way down. I'm gonna set this at like 25, maybe a little bit more. Yeah, like 28. Cool, and just like that, we're already sort of starting to get a cool look. Now I'm gonna go over here to my project file. Reminder, you can grab this film grain asset on my website for free. And I'm gonna drag this into our timeline. And you're definitely gonna have to play around with the blending modes to make this work with your footage. So I'm gonna set this to, to screen, or you can maybe even do overlay. You can kind of play around with it. But you're definitely gonna to wanna to turn this down. So I'm gonna put it on like 50%. Let's even do something lower, like 35. And let's see how that looks really quick. I'm gonna render. Yo, and this already looks really cool and looks like a fun vintage look. But obviously with color grading, you're always gonna to wanna to sort of adjust. So really quick, I'm just gonna go into this top one. I'm gonna make some basic color corrections just to sort of make this footage pop a little bit more. Now, really, if you were really trying to dial this in, you'd probably want to go clip by clip and make these adjustments, but I'm just going to do it to the global adjustment layer. So one second. Sweet. Now we're going to just render this one more time and see what we cooked up. Hey, yo, and just like that, we have a really cool color grade. Now I think this looks really cinematic and it's a fun look overall. So definitely go check out my store, download these assets for free and use them in your video edits.